Hello and welcome to Latest TV's big news show live from the heart of Brighton. I'm James Dunham and here are the headlines at three o'clock. The place for business, Brighton tops the tree when it comes to companies starting out. Exhausted, villagers urge action now to combat the growing problem of air pollution. And going underground, we explore the mysterious salt caves of Hove. Well, Mike, you join me on top of Mill Hill in Shoreham, which just overlooks the crash site on the A27, where Saturday's devastating events occurred. Now, the weather today being pretty horrendous, not helping the police operation as hundreds of officers try to piece together what's actually happened. Patients in Sussex will suffer under changes to ambulance services. That's according to union chiefs. Co-performer will take over the running of patient transportation from CCAM, who currently receive all emergency calls. Here's Gary Palmer from the GMB speaking to Frank LeDuc on the vote. It would often attract tens of thousands of people on bank holidays in the 1950s. And despite seeing a decline in the 80s and 90s, in the last 10 years or so, there's been a lot of support. The funding announcement comes as a massive achievement for the campaign group who've been battling to try and restore the velodrome to its former glory. And although they admit that there are still hurdles to overcome, the project is pedalling forward. How does it make you feel as a parent yourself seeing images of children on TV, for example, you know, fleeing their homeland? It's almost quite hard to sort of look at those images and kind of connect with what that really means for those parents. The ice rink here in Worthing is bigger and better than any year before. With a larger space and better facilities, it certainly is giving Worthing a festive feel. It's got to hurt. Right, that's all from us for now. Mike Mendoza will be here with more on those stories together with the rest of today's developments on Latest TV's big news show at 3 o'clock. Until then, have a lovely afternoon. Bye-bye.